Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone and welcome to San Diego. As you can tell, I am not in my own kitchen again. I'm actually in this amazing vintage trailer that I booked up on Airbnb. And I wanna show you today um, how to make this amazing watermelon salad and a few little tips and tricks about watermelon and basil. But before we get into that, let's talk a little bit about San Diego. If you're unfamiliar with San Diego, we have amazing Mexican food here. In fact, we're just a hop, skip and a jump from Tijuana. So you can actually head down to Mexico yourself if you want like the real stuff. There's also great beaches here, amazing parks. Balboa Park is a wonderful one, unless you get lost in it like I did. And the animal parks are actually fun too. Like there's a great zoo, there's SeaWorld, which is perfect if you wanna pet dolphins or just, you know, protest the fact that they have dolphins, whatever floats your boat. But also, if you're kind of curious what San Diego actually means, take a moment and watch this clip. Discovered by the Germans in 1904, they named it San Diego which of course in German means a whale's vagina. <laughs> okay, so San Diego probably doesn't mean whale's vagina, but there's a lot going on in San Diego. There's a lot more than animal parks. There's a lot more than surfing. There's there's Comic-Con, uh, great things to do. So put on your underoos, get out your Wonder Woman tights or whatever, and let's make this watermelon salad. Okay, so let's get into making this uh, grilled watermelon salad. But before I do that, I just wanna let you know to check out my how-to on how to pick a watermelon because honestly, if you have a crappy watermelon, then you're gonna have a crappy salad. So first thing first, cut into the watermelon. Oh, how great does that look? Love that color. And now we're just gonna cut the watermelon into wedges. It's nice and thick here. That's what she said. Now that we got the grill going, we're just gonna grill the watermelon for a few minutes just till it's seared on each side. To make our salad, we're gonna put out some fresh basil. By the way, be sure to watch my how-to on how to store basil because if you've ever had basil turn black on you in the fridge, it's not appreciated. So I have a quick little how-to on that. Add on the grilled watermelon and I have my bag of sliced up heirloom cherry tomatoes here. And also speaking of how-tos, if you want to know how I sliced all of these in one fell swoop, I have a how-to on that, because that's that's just what I do. I create how-tos. So, got our cherry tomatoes. And we're going to add in some fresh mozzarella. And then we're just going to finish it all off with a balsamic glaze. Accommodations provided by Airbnb. 